they have come up with an update for hardships uh, hardships icebreaker i can't even see the name of the game it's a very soothing game i'm very stressed i do hard space ship a breaker that's it it is an early access uh so i haven't actually so far up seen any bugs they have like upgraded the tools and stuff they did reset me once which annoyed me because i'd come pretty far um so yep early access can we please not be resetted uh i always do an uh yeah campaign act two today i always do an open shift uh, you can do standard, which is unlimited lives, but you work on the clock, time is money. I found that extremely annoying that I had to stop what I was doing in my life when I was in the zone and go back into the, to the, the habitat and have a rest. I mean, I didn't mind the money, not at all. Like, you just clock me the money, I don't mind. Uh, limited is three, 30 revives for the whole campaign. I don't die a lot. I don't so far. But I've been, I've been pretty good. No revival, one life. I have died. Has happened by accident. I have. So let's see. What's this then? Campaign Act 2. Continue the story of the dramatic Act 1 finale. Oh dear. Administer Hal Rodas arrives to on-site to oversee operations. So campaign act one was like you're breaking down these ships, which is fun, but you also had this the workers union are workers are trying to start a union to fight back because of all the amazing costs you have to pay all the time. Oh my god, are you kidding me? This update resets progression? No! Reminder that the tutorial series can be skipped by choosing skip trade. No, please tell me you didn't do it. Oh, yeah, anyway, a remote shift timer and oxygen drain. Yes, I do ignore a relaxed experience. Are you kidding me that you reset me again? I hate you, game. Humankind has industrialized much of the solar system. Earth has deteriorated into a place of squalor and decay. In orbit, a new breed of worker has emerged. The ship breaker. Dun dun dun. The labor is extremely dangerous. But for a select few, the hazard pay is worth the risk. Oh, don't reset me. Oh, don't reset me. I hate you. <laughs> Food shorters continues. Yep, they reset me. This is the start. This is me pondering if I should mute myself and curse for five minutes. <laughs> Just Network time remaining. Two days. Add something. Shipwreck application. Pave the way to the Galaxy program. Update on your applications. Do that is. Fort shortages on Earth here. Blockade against across the Central Plains. Confederacy can green contamination something. We got... This is the one, and we have a final notice. Credit transfer declined. Patient payment required. Any rations to spare? Please respond. Office of civilian something. Mom, important. Dad sick again. Bill pass two. Send your notice. So, whoever we are, we want to get off Earth. But on the other hand, we got to see all the nasty Nazis corporation now. The Link Salvage Division employment confirmation form. Rating Citizens LF 2911805. Congratulations on accepted into the links. Pave the way to the Galaxy program. From over 124.8 million applicants, you were chosen based on above average slash exceptional physical and cognitive ability. That's -a me! Participation in this program can be lucrative and rewarding depending on a willingness to follow the vision and process of the Lynx Corporation. You have been assigned to Salvage Station 42, designation Morgan. This station currently has no additional personnel, but if you are able to demonstrate the ability to build and grow a profitable operation, a number of exciting opportunities await you. Remember, employment in the Pave the Way to the Galaxy program is at the sole discretion of the Lynx Corporation and can be wrote at any time. Acts of insubordination and malice will not be tolerated. On receipt of your electronic signature, a shuttle will be deployed immediately to your current location to deliver you to your post. Training will commence immediately on arrival. Finalize your info on the following pages to confirm employment. 
next. Thanks, accountant. Yep, we are a chibi kitten. Chibi lotten, apparently, but no, kitten. Links work effort trafficking TM and employee social hub require an employee account name. Please enter an account name below. Profanity or anti corporate slang jargon is not accepted. Maybe kitten is bad. Select revival package. We proudly offer our Everwork asset replacement program to new employees. Lower the details on your select spare package terrain health board advisory. It only has a 0.02 chance of DNA corruption. So we have unlimited spares, but it will cost us 150 grand every time we die. Voice ID verification. To verify your identity, confirm the voice file you submitted in your original application. Links voice ID is a security measure to press your data. Maybe that one. Select preferences. Select orientation scheme for your personal mobility unit. Status indicates. No, we are standard since we are on a mouse. <laughs> okay. This is nice. Meal preference. Our food processors can serve a variety of dietary preferences. Food cost is based on current market value and may change over time. We can do chicken, plastic free, vegetarian, or entomotorian. I'm thinking plastic free is the way for us. Like, can I choose several? <laughs> no? Okay. Process. Uh, press agree to each statement. I have no criminal record in the Terran or Martian zones. Our record in the Jovian frontier is acceptable. No, we don't. I'm not a member of, I have never been associated with a workers' union. Oh no, it must be an American company. Workers' unions are great. Okay, when they behave. Like, they don't do, like, mafia methods. No. Or other labor interests. I guess, no. I have completed my annual medical exam and have been cleared of having McCullough's lung. Okay. I have no commercial or real estate interest on Luna, in the asteroid belt, or in the nation state of Arizona. Nation state of Arizona? I will bring a positive attitude and problem solving mindset to work every day. Yes. Yes, we can do that. I understand and accept the health risk associated with long term exposure to the Van der Waals field. Ah, cancer. I will vote for Chancellor Chung Chang in the Pan American Senate election. <laughs> so that's like a, that's like how you have to vote apparently if you want to work here. Mm. Some water, it's dang warm. Uh, okay, we're not to love press next without clicking that. The agreement is made as a. Oh my god. Okay, let's read it. Positive, yes. This agreement is made on the 9th of November 2329 between Lynx Corporation Department and Salvage and Reclamation Incorporated under the laws of the Solar Industries Commission, Lynx and myself, Citizen LF, something something, employee. Employee hereby grants for permission to Lynx to author the authority to collect, analyze, and utilize the biometric data we use to better the lives and well being of them and their co workers as well as any other purpose. Like what? Okay. Employee hereby grants permission to Lynx the authority to perform the psychological tests on them at any time with or without their knowledge. Employee are not entitled to compensation for participation in these tests, but may receive additional sugar cube rations. Mmm, yummy sugar cubes. Employee hereby grants permission to Lynx the authority to garnish their wages if their actions or lack thereof result in any real or potential losses for the company and or and of its affiliates. Employee hereby grants permission to Lynx the authority in perpetuity to record and own their DNA and to create new entities with that DNA with no restrictions or limits. That sounds shady as F. Furthermore, employee agrees to pay a nominal fee for the service in the event of their death while performing their duties of their position. Lynx may execute these entities at any time for acts of gross net claims. So we can be cloned if we die, but they may kill that clone. Employee hereby grants permission to Lynx, the authority, to study, manipulate, re reciprocate, and duplicate any and all of my grey and white matter at any time, in the unfortunate event of my total and complete loss of memory. Employee hereby grants permission to Lynx, the authority, to transfer any and all unpaid debts owed to two Lynx and or, uh, and or of its affiliates to the next of kin, in the event that they are terminated, disappear, or perma-perish. So... Our debt is now our 
dad's sick dad's dead, I guess. Thanks for serving the right to terminate the contract at any time without notice or payment in lieu with no requirement of sufficient cost. So it's a really shady contract. Let's not skip the training since we're starting from the beginning. Ugh. I'm gonna grumble about this. Twice now I worked my way up. You will see why it matters. There goes our shuttle. Let's hope that's not our daughter. Gorgeous. Each day he steps into the yard to earn his wages working hard. I pray to the stars and heaven above to return my daddy to those he loves. There comes a time when he and death meet. Let's the next cutter that takes your seat. This is such a beautiful little prayer. Oh, there's another one, shipbreaker. It's so cool. They did write something that they have also downgraded the graphics of it, so it should look really old timey and bad. So it's it, the game is supposed to look like this. It used to look a lot more snazzy, but you can apparently disable it. Calusia, what a name. Here, nice. That hard workers like you, the backbone of civilization, will help us pave the way to the galaxy. I am Calusia Rye Paulson, president of Lynx Corporation Salvage Division. When my great great grandfather, Exeter, founded Lynx, he Exeter, also a nice name. Remarkable opportunity among the stars. His vision eventually brought us the railgate. Oh, we can see one of those. Now spanning all the way to Jupiter, these are the veins connecting all of modern civilization, and the people flowing through them are its lifeblood. The railgates reinvigorated humanity, and are key to our continued progress. You have been selected from among thousands of candidates to join the Lynx family. This is more than just a job. It's an opportunity to be part of the largest, most successful, and most pioneering company in human history. Your dream may be to forge your own destiny one day. Well, work hard, heed your superiors, believe in the Lynx vision. Do this, and you too will get your chance. Your first step is to join our EverWork program. The greatest gift we give our employees, turning death into an ongoing opportunity <laughs> for learning and growth. You mean Remember, earning money on it as well? Death is a fresh start. Good luck. Because, I mean, they don't actually need to train everyone. Yep, I want a fresh start. Press begin ex genetic extraction. Video observation complete. To finalize onboarding, your genetic sequence will now be extracted for use with the Lynx Everwork Asset Replacement Program. Ooh. Don't worry, pain levels during extraction are largely tolerable. <laughs> largely tolerable? Please note, as outlined in section 31 of your employment agreement, the process of genetic extraction will destroy your original body. Wow. So oh, you just. He oh God Oh that gives me two bumps Oh Extraction analysis and backup complete Thank you Beginning spare generation 
You basically kill off the person you just spent tons of money to hide. He hoist up there? Congratulations! It's now safe to die! Ship breaks are responsible for the cost of biomaterials bio bio used in every process. An additional fee is required for death that occur outside working hours. You may now proceed with salvaging training. Good luck! Okay. Loading fees reports. So this is all we owe them, just for taking this job. The citizens report check. 120,000. Medical analysis. 362,000. How that... Transportation to work site where they can kill you, 510,000. Seat selection fee, 10,000. <sighs> or is it 10 million? No, I think it's 10,000. Luggage handling, including gratuity, 35%. Done in 12,000. Automated onboarding, uh, automated onboarding procedure, 1,200,000. Lifeguard Unity Backup Storage, 500 million, I think that is. <laughs> so, as you can see, the lousing cost us uh, one and a half million almost. Habitation fee, cleaning and repainting, six million. On-site training, eight million. Helmet interface software update. Like they're, they're, yeah. Display of fees report, 750. Like they are... They want, they're worse than, than Tom Nook in uh, <laughs> Animal Crossing. Now let's put our agreement to that. Today, the industries around Mars are responsible for over 78, 70% of all the shipping in the solar system. Okay. Just fine. There you go. Plenty of folks feel a bit woozy with their first fare. Ooh, anyway, that's one of the rail welcome aboard. ones. The name's Weaver. I'm the foreman for yourself and a couple of the other shipbreakers in this region. Uh huh. This here's Morgan Station. She may not look like much right now, but once we boot her up, she'll purr like a kitten. Well, we can purr together. Let's test out your orientation control. Do me a favor and look up at that cargo elevator up above. Ooh. That's it. So that's where all the salvage gets collected to be picked up by the transfer crew. Just in case you ever turn yourself out of whack, use your roll thrusters to reorient. I can't move anywhere. You're wondering why I'm doing Except what they tell me I can do, let like, not forward or backwards or anything. Now let's get you flying. Activating your thruster controls now. So you were the one that had try moving around. Okay. Thrust forwards. Whoop. Uh thrust the left, thrust right, and backwards. Now vertical control. Ascend. And descend. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Now to Looks good. these movement checks, I need you to fly to these waypoints. Whoop, we have waypoints. Can I whoop break? Thank you. Where's the waypoints? There. I can do that. Yay. Used to be a cutter myself, mm -hmm. you know. Till there were some uh, uh, complications with my last revive. Uh-huh. Really? Almost forgot about the most important thing. Brakes. Get yourself going at a decent clip, and then test them out, why don't you? I did. I do know the brakes. Them dang brakes. Right. Looks like the bay here was left in a bit of a mess. Uh-huh. The original iteration of this game didn't actually have this. They just, you were just here and it was just done. So I understood that that was furnaces. Didn't know what that was though. 
Yeah, they have a nasty suction okay. field. Let's get a handle on your grapple tool. This fella here is a shipbreaker's bread and butter. This is how we move salvage around. Activate the beam and hold it to grab an object and move it around. If it's not too heavy, give it a go. Oh. Guessing not that. So when you're holding an object with the grapple, you can retract the beam. This will pull a light object to you. If it's heavier than you, it will you <laughs> towards it. Nice job cleaning up all that soft metal scrap cutter. Uh, let's move on to the bigger nano carbon chunks now, shall we? You may have already noticed that these are too heavy to move with your grapple. Uh huh. Enabling your scanner so we can check out their structural makeup. You haven't changed that. This mode of your scanner lets you assess an object's structure. What I want you to focus on right now are these cut points. Yep. You have quick access to all your tools through your HUD. This is how they have so changed, the though, I think. Selector and choose the cutting tool. Nope, right. they haven't. Good. Control has given me the go ahead. I don't really like that uh, the tool menu, which is this. Your tool has two modes. The first one is the stinger. It's designed for precision vaporization of cut points like this. You ready to perform some zero G surgery cutter? Yeah, if you let me. So it's light enough to move. What? Oh my god, it's so short. Yeah, the processor was uh, a bit confusing in the start of the game without this. So I can see if they activate right. Yeah, perfect. Wish me luck here, Cutter. Me and technology ain't always the best of friends. Sounds okay, great, considering right. that it's us that does it. Now swap over to your gravel and toss one of them pieces you separated right in there. Oh, it's so heavy! <laughs> it's 1,197 kilos. Meh. There we go. And we can put that one in this. So, what I did in my first thing was actually fly into one of these because I had no idea what they were. There was no explanation. Well, okay. We're almost done getting this bay in shape. Let's go yeah. Ahead. Oh, please tell me I got them. Oh, I thought I got the wires. It is for the oven, right? For the yes. I don't dare go to go too close, or we will get sucked into that sucker. Out. This is a little home. These are like anchors to help us later. Yep, and the shift 
So this is what we earned. We did a little bit. Look, we earned a lot. I feel at least. 618. 729. Ta-da! We got the face notification. Okay. Now it's summary. And this one. And shift. There we go. Nearly all traditional forms of farming and food production have been entirely replaced by vast algae and insect production. That's kind of healthy. Oh, we got a proper home? This is new. Oh, this is super new. I wish you could go around just uh, properly. Officially called a ready made long term employee habitation. We can't pay to get this well, stuff painted. Your hands. Now, how's about you get yourself some rest and we'll pick up your training in the morning? Oh, okay. Living space, the bed. Yeah, that was new. That was nice. Ship breaker. Please enjoy this inspirational message. Uh -huh. The last ten percent of a job takes as much energy as the first ninety percent. So think of what it takes to hit one hundred and ten percent and aim for that. <laughs> sure. Good morning, shipbreaker. Remember, minimum payments are due by 10 a.m. Solar Standard Time each day. Fair to pay on time is considered a breach of contract. Thank you for your hard work and cooperation. Tab close. Got it. Rise and shine, Cutter. Hope you feel uh -huh. well rested. Okay, complete ready terminal. We can't do anything okay. with that. Kitchen? Have a look at your oh, live, laugh, now, salvage. What, at my workstation or which computer? This one? No. Living space. This is a bit clunky. This one. Okay. This is fine. Clear Notification. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm here to walk you through the process, and soon enough I'm going to introduce you to some of the other shipbreakers. Most of them are willing to help you out, too. <laughs> All right. Let's start a new shift and pick your first ship to work on. So what does it say? Certification system is our proprietary career progression tool for all our shipbreakers. It provides each employee with a fulfilling and promising future as part of the Lynx family. Certification ranks range from as the entry point all the way up to rank 30, which is reserved only for the most accomplished employees. This is advised to view the certification tab in your hub terminal as a guide to gain access to more tools, upgrades, ships, and hazard levels. Proving yourself as a loyal and skilled employee will reward you with fresh new challenges in the work bay. And we got, uh, how do I, back, well, that's still as clunky as possible. Structure mode is pre-installed on your every optic and cross spectrum scanner unit in the standard issue links worksuit. The mode is core part in the ship shipbreaker toolkit as it lets you assess the structural makeup of a ship clearly demarcating demo whole panel structural beams and important cut points. Structure mode is default mode when you activate your scanner unless you were previously using a different mode. Okay. Everything important and good in your world comes with a price. Each privileged person who joins our family to become a shipbreaker become, comes with significant costs. Fortunately, Link's shoulders the burden of these costs temporarily in order to let you hit the ground running and become training stress-free. This cost sharing is handled through our innovative employee financial relief program. This program covers all the essential onboarding costs and fees, including the cost of training and equipment, Borrowed from Link Salvage. Also included is a fee for the Everwork Asset, Asset Replacement Program, which enables safe and unlimited career progression and growth through the power of Link's technology. In return, as your skills and XP grows, all the value that you earn as a shipbreaker will automatically deduct from the amount you owe to the Financial Relief Program. This ensures that the borrowed amount is paid off as quickly as possible so you can get out with building yourself a brighter future. Okay, salvage goals. Well, we, we understand what that was. And uh, what's that? Oh, yeah, this is one of the chips we can break down, which is 
I know, so many times it's a bit boring. I had hope for new ships. Okay, okay. We can't do anything here. Can we do anything with our suits? I know. Posters confirm. Can we do anything? Live lap. Let's just put it as as home, I guess. Back tab. Okay. Um. Workstation. This is a bit clunky. Why don't you just let me walk around freely? That would have been so much easier. Use the chip catalog. The catalog that, shows you which ships you have that was like over here somewhere. But that didn't work that well, if I remember right. We have two different kinds of ship. We have this one and that one. So, we can see a bit to the right. What the heckins they are about? They all have to deliver zero. Usually, what I check is this, like what they guess the value is on each ship. So, okay, so my greedy one. This is eight hundred and fifty-four thousand. Uh, yes. Reach certification rank three. And this is a macro with light cargo. Yep, he's starting up our machines. Thank you. No. Oh, this is so empty. Okay, this is turning creepy. Basically, this is it. Turns out harder. Um, look for these cut points. Usually, it has like tons of stuff for you to. Uh, oh, okay. If we can pull this door out, yep. Okay, without crushing our screen. Ooh, that's a thingy. Hello, thingy. Pick this up. F. Thank you. Um. It is four neat balls, to be honest. This this game. It's extremely soothing to just tear apart ships. Also, you have to. It, it's weirdly a bit like Hitman. You need to know where to start to pull to unravel things. Not in these easier ones, but the stuff are like pressurized stuff are not pressurized if you hit too hole close to some stuff it will explode and uh, just uh load you two or half the ship and you will destroy things but this is our first ship so i'm guessing they're gonna make it very easy for us i don't see any lamps that we need to take care of i don't see any pressurized these yellow things are all the cut points we need to cut up. I don't see a reactor in here either, which can be a bit of a hassle. The reactor, because you only have a limited time when they are to actually put them into where they should be. The barge below us or above us, depending on how you're aimed at the moment. There we go. 
This one too. Yep, starts to float out. Oh, sorry for that. This is not usually how I do it, but I'm thinking if it spoils me that rotten that I can just take out all the... Yeah, that's gonna be a hassle, isn't it? Nope, not even a doorknob to pull off. That's interesting. And this way, usually there's an airlock. You have to fiddle around a bit. But nope. This is ultra easy mode. Da, 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 da. Go. And there we go. Won't lie, this is what I would watch if I need to sleep. I like looking at things like this. And there. And there. You think we got everything now? Let's watch for tea. What have I forgotten? Oh, we've forgotten something down there. Whatever that is. Here we are. And that one. And this one. Got all of them? Can we just start to gently... Nope, oh, there's more out there. Let's see, everything should have start to drift it apart a little bit, which is good. Usually there's like a thrusters here. If you just pull this out, you can damage everything inside. But... Not today. Anything else? Oop, we have forgotten one. Yep. Okie dokie. And, uh... Usually I can't actually cut these apart. Can I do that this time? Let's see what it thinks. Let's see what it thinks. No! The lack of a change to the icon means no way in the hell you can do anything about that. Okay. Sure. Let's try and get some momentum. Can you push it? Boink! Boink! I don't have any tethers, so I can't sadly either them together either. Like we saw in the intro, which had, would have been cool. We a lot of patience. Okay. Hopefully we're gonna earn a buck on this. Buck or two even. There we go. Hope you go to the red right place. Yep, processor. How did you know we needed credits? Ah, oh, don't go into the barbecue. Thank you. There we go. Come on. There we go. Right, it's awarded. Let's do some from this side as well. Come on. Get, get loose. Get loose. There we go. 
I think. Ooh. Wow, hello. I know went a little bit. Everything calm down. Everything calm down. How badly did I hurt it? Eh, not too bad. Could have been worse. Okay. Uh, we reached goal number one. I'm fairly certain we can reach all the goals. There shouldn't be a problem. I can just aim at myself properly. There we go. Oh, this door. What? What? Is it going to the furnace or is it going... Okay. Fair enough. There you go. Nope. It didn't like that. Perhaps you should have cut it up in little pieces. Okay, let's see here. Let's check a little more closely then. This does say furnace, right? Nope. Not all of it. What's this processor? That's his processor. This is furnace. Usually you can't cut up stuff that has the processors. Whoop. You're going to the furnace. Go. And come on, don't, don't. There we go. Let. Oop. Too much. Too much. Whoop. Stay here, please. You're going to the furnace. Be careful so I don't smack myself in the face. Which happens more often than I want to confess to. Okay. If we can line it up nice. Here we go. You go in there. And you go in there. Credits awarded. Credits awarded. As you see in the in the bar and to the upwards, you have a little bit of red and that stuff I've destroyed accidentally. Oopsie poopsie. Okay. That looks very tough. You then processor. I'm gonna double check it a little bit more carefully. Processor. Nope, oh, seems to just be processor pieces. There we go. Now, oh, nice and slow. Ooh, don't overshoot. Come on. Ah, uh, it's so weak, this thing! Come on. You can do it! Suck it in! And there it goes. Mooms, 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 mooms. Don't tell me I don't take you anywhere. I wonder how long it takes. I'm guessing then the theory is that it gets... Taken to this one and stored in the ring. Guessing. Okie dokie. Let's see what do we. This is a huge thing. Let's start with that thing. Processor, 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 processor. Okay. Processor. Ooh, and it's heavy. Ooh, it's heavy. There we go. And go! Box it! Punch it! Move it! Here we go. Just checking so it really gets into there. Okay. Um, that's gonna be a beep to handle. Okay, so. This thing. 
Does any of this need to get to the burner? Nope, seems to be processed all over. Oop. Okay, let's see what we can get away with. Oop, oop. Wasn't too happy there, was it? Let's ooh, look at this. Let's see if we can pull that away from from everything. And let's hope I'm guessing right that most of it is for process. Okay. Processing valuable object. Processing valuable object. Okay. And you? Processor, processor, processor. Got it. There we go. This is, oh, oh, this is an easy piece. Whee! There we go. You go in there. And this looks so heavy, and we can't cut in, in processor stuff usually. You can see there's no red line. It's a bit of a, yeah. Furnace, furnace. Furnace can usually cut stuff in. And it used to be so that these things, well, first of all, they were just blocks, but they also were to the, not the furnace, the other thing. So you had to cut them out one by one, and it was such a hassle. But everything here seems to be furnace now, which I do appreciate. Yep, everything seems to be furnace. So what do we do with this little lump of thing? Well, let's start with this. Let's see if we can cut it up in some sort of manageable pieces. Ah, oh, they haven't fixed that. Okay. Sometimes you have to cut it twice. And sometimes it even gets stuck. Which can be extremely annoying. Like you have cut loose a piece but it doesn't realize it. So it's like, no, no, I'm gonna stay here forever, thanks. You got it loose. Yep, seems we did. That's the first time that worked properly for me. Here we go. Into the process with you. Can we actually move this whole thing? Uh, yeah, fairly well. But that thing is in the way. Well, let's try and move it to this furnace instead. See if we can sneak it around. Material deposit, that's good. Yeah, getting into the oven. And bake. Now this. Oh wait, take this first. And go! Uh, do we have anything else? Oh, we have that. That's, this is all the processor. Can we move it? Or is, is it we that's moving or is it the thing that's moving? Sometimes when I'm trying to get things to either the processor or the, the fire, the other oven takes it accidentally. It just sucks it in. I'm a bit worried. I think the oven has a stronger suction than the processor. That's how it feels, at least. Okay. And now we have uh, this. Processor. Oh, something is furnace. Oh. This is not the funniest. The question is if I should just cut my losses, just throw them into either. Because this one is usually not fun. Like this door hole. No. 
There we go. Yeah, let's uh furnace a processor. Let's just throw it in. I'm not really in the mood to cut it all up. Because it's so it would be nice if you could just cut everything, but you can't. Come on, in there. It's more like some things you can cut out and then you just end up gutting it. So let's, let's take a cut our losses and let it be grumpy. Let it be grumpy. There we go. See, we did hit goal number three. And certification rank two. But we had a lot of it destroyed thanks to that last thing. But that's fine. That's fine. That is fine. There we go. Yep. And the shit. So this this is a bit of a shame. I can't see how much value I destroyed for, but we did still go plus. Oh, there we go. We destroyed for eighty-two thousand. So that's that's kind of okay. Destroyed nine point almost ten percent. Oof. That was ninety percent. And apparently forgot one hundred and ten credits out there. And shifts. Yay! Level Does this mean we can actually start to upgrade our stuffs now? That would be nice. Cutter 9346-52. Wow. Leave period is now over. Have a great day. Thank you! Good morning. Yep, yep, you want me to pay stuffs. How about no for this moment? Let's see the employee terminal. Whoop. Messages too. Uh, certification, we've seen that, right? Uh, which are unread? Salvage goals. Oh no, hazards fire. Oh dear. I don't like fires. We're on three. Look at this. I never got it to 30. And I'm happy since they were so happy to just sort reset me again. They're dastardly people. Equipment. Yes, please. So we can earn stickers. <laughs> Which, which is such a fun detail. I love this detail. So, let's see. it's the grapple, and this is the cutter, and we can earn these stickers and slap them on there. Two, oh, five unique geckos. I've never done the geckos. Oh, the javelins are, are tricky. See, what's this? All hail the machine god stickers. Okay. Clean your plate qualified. Salvage so 10 food packs. I don't know what that is. Um, why can't we look at our suits? I'm sorry. That's weird. Let's just check the catalog. You chef catalog, please. No, I didn't want to do that. Let me see. Can I do... Can I? Hurry and chip. Like, we have destroyed all of this. Well, that's fine. Didn't I go through the pages last time? Yeah, Q and R. But not this time. Acid level 2. Okay, 
So I'm gonna we're gonna do that next time, I think. If I do another stream of this, if you really like it, please tell me and I'll continue this stream series and I'll also go with the uh, Hitman one, which you almost finished. So this might be a good game we pick up. Uh push the like button, press the subscribe button. One is pink and the other one is white. Both are fussy with little ears and whiskers. One of them purse and one of them mouse. You have to find out which is which. And I'll